we are back again checking out four more terraria like games that some of you may have not heard of obviously some of you may have heard of these and some of you may have not that's just how it works i do just want to quickly insert that me calling these games quote unquote terraria clones is not meant to be a negative thing at all it's literally just a title that i'm giving to these games don't think about it too hard i'm talking to the starbound fans out there like literally can't even read the comments of the last video because i don't know i guess everyone thought it was a negative thing that i compared starbound to terraria even though i didn't say a single bad thing about starbound starbound is probably the next game i would play if it wasn't terraria but with that said let's hop into our first game we're checking out here called Kraya. all right let's get to it we're playing Kraya. celebrating 10 years damn this game 10 years old oh this is oh my god this is the game that i played it was Kraya. look my old world <laughs> terraria copied this game i like this menu i'm not gonna lie the menu is nice music is nice i'm gonna name my character allergic to the sun that's why he's super pasty white i feel so zoomed out can i zoom in let's get it craya season this is just like starbound this is a starbound like game nobody's ever said that before i like that you can like hang on to stuff that's kind of cool planet centauri like let's fight I'm over here fighting speep, not sheep, speep. Yeah, fight me, bro. I would have blocked that. Even if that came near me, I would have blocked it. Oh, yeah. I'm about to die. I died. <laughs> where where my iframes at? Kill this thing, bro. Finally. Tanky ass enemy. Playing more Game Raiders clones. Oh, that's easy to find. That's like all new to it. Oh, I didn't say that. Fireball? Oh, shit who trying to he jumped he jumped over my attack he's a fucking god got him get him yeah fucked him up you're next crafting that means it's a minecraft clone talent oh i almost have enough to get a talent okay i like this i like this this should look like fortnite now that i look at it i'm gonna be on to something why is there so many beef in my damn house? This is gonna be my house. No beef allowed. No speeps allowed, please. This is my home. All right, paper? You know Game Raiders is about his paper. Not really, people don't watch my videos, so I'm broke. Make a Minecraft clone video and put Terraria in the thumbnail? I might have to. I do like how the character looks in this game. They look really funny. The game seems cool so far, but like, it seems like everything I play that isn't Terraria is a downgrade from Terraria. Like, it really just shows you how much Terraria stands over any other game that's like it. Like, playing any game like this just makes you want to go play Terraria more. Like, am I wrong? <laughs> game seems very slow paced, though. I know one thing a lot of people hate about Terraria is restarting a playthrough. I honestly enjoy restarting a playthrough Terraria because that's, like, the, the moment you see most of the new shit you're going to see, you know? Like, what type of world you're going to get, what type of items you're going to find early game, you know, what's really going to decide your playthrough, what you're going to play as, if you didn't decide that beforehand obviously so me starting over a terraria playthrough that's usually my favorite moment so like a game having a little slow start like this people might not like it unless you're really fascinated did i just do a roll oh shit that's nice, clean points for the roll system dark souls hold up this is a souls like i thought this was a terraria like now nah, it's a souls like now I, all i don't have is my pants hold on, i got points i can put up put up attack put up attack again why not boom Oh man, I fucked him up. Whoa. Get rolled on. Oh, blocked. Oh, he's shooting fire. Oh, get blocked, pussy. Hit him. Oh, got him with the fire combo breaker. Oh my God, I was fucking him up. I like how every game does the map like this now. <laughs> We've seen, what, like three games that do the map like this? Where it's, you know, a little tiny map, little mini map. Then you got the little translucent map on the screen. And then you got the full screen map. <gasps> Bro, I wasn't even looking. I was reading chats. <laughs> a slight fall. Discover and activate way crystals to quickly travel between them. Hold up. They did this first. They did this before pylons. And that kind of looked like a pylon too. Hold up. Terraria copied this game's feature? That's a title. That's a whole last video right there. Little, little magic wand that shoots was bubbles. I don't know. <laughs> I like that you could dual wield the, the melee and the magic. That's kind of clean. That's low key kind of clean. 
There's a sprint in this game? Oh my god, you can sprint. <laughs> okay, the movement might be a little bit more clean than Terraria, man. I'm not gonna lie. There's a sprint. There's a roll. You can hang on the ledges. That's kind of fire. Yes, sir. We got a spear. Let's see it in action. Oh, yeah. Oh, he does a little combo. Look at that. Look at the little combo. That's cool. Throwing class? No items available. Just like Terraria. Classic. I think that's enough for me and Kraya. I like it. I like this one. This definitely feels the most like Terraria out of all of them. With its own little, you know, extra features here and there. Its own uniqueness here and there. It does feel a little slow. It feels uh, definitely slow paced at the beginning. I can see people getting bored before they even get started. I'm going to give it a nice, uh, i say with 8 out of 10. Just because it, it feels a little slow. Not a lot of action going on. Which is hard to compare to Terraria's early game. Just because I like Terry's early game so much. Next game. This was a game people were recommending. Y'all think I'm lying. No cap. I would never lie. That is me if I were a character. That's me right there. That's what I look like. That's me right there. That's what I look like. Name Wee Wee. Shit, I don't even gotta... I don't even gotta change the name. Now, people are saying... The people that recommended this in the comments are saying like, hey, try this game out. It's a top down sort of Terraria game. So we got a different perspective. Still a 2D pixelated game, but you know, at least we got a different perspective. I'm looking for a quest. If you place a settlement flag, I'll find some quests for you. I'm going into your house. This is now my house. Settlement flag. He had the settlement flag all along. Wee Weeville. Boom. This looks like an Xbox Live Arcade free trial. This looks bad like it was made on scratch. So you can't judge a game based on appearances. Come on now. That's like being racist. You guys are technically racist. Craft a ladder. Use it to go underground. Oh. Yo. Goblin. Oh, shit. I'm getting jumped. I'm getting jumped. Oh, my God. That was fucking terrifying. <laughs> I got jumped as soon as I came down here. Oh, look, give me that money. You know, gamers gets to the bag. Nah, that's a lie. People don't watch my videos. Oh, don't come near me. What is a vampire? Hey, I ain't got no health, bro. I like the Minecraft, the old Minecraft hit noise. <laughs> yeah. In the clips already. It's over, guys. Early game eclipse coming. Hold up, let me use some bread. Never mind, I'm not hungry. You know, Game Raider just gets to the bread. Nah, nobody watches my videos. I don't make money anymore. You think that's a joke, too? That's the funny thing. The music fucking bumping in this bitch. Oh, hold up. Zombies? Giant cave spiders? And hey, the enemy variation going crazy already. I gotta go say what's up to the giant enemy spider. Oh, shit! Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, it's a goblin. Oh, damn. Oh, damn, he's on my ass. Oh, damn. I ain't got a lot of health. Uh, how did I eat food and my health went down? Ah! The jo ah! He's poisons. Bro, I got one health, literally. I need to get out. Holy shit. <laughs> that was crazy. That combat might have been more exciting than terraria bro that was insane that had the adrenaline pumping travel out the water to the edge of the map you'll be able to go to other islands islands have different biomes and features that sounds pretty cool i like that and look you got a little island map this is reminding me of the pixel piracy can i fight a cow do cows fight back thank god they don't fight back hold up night time is coming this game kind of cool see this is why we don't judge games by looks now I'm seeing why a lot of people recommend it. Because it's kind of clean. Kill evil protectors. Summon at night by using a mysterious portal. Hold up, boss fight already? Elder, you think I'm ready to take on a boss? Okay, my goal is going to be to fight a boss and then I'll stop playing this game. Oh, yeah, I could get like butt ass naked. That's already a better feature than Terraria. I had the breeze just hitting my balls. Why should be a trap? If this is a trap. Be oh, hold up. <laughs> Handgun? My boy got the Glocky. This really is Terraria. Bah! 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 This is amazing. This game is amazing. Bow! 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 I gotta work on my aim. My aim is a little off. Traveling merchant. Bald headed ass. Every other summon is an archer. Used to focus in my. Hold up. They got summoners? No way this game got summons too. No way, right? My favorite class? Okay. I like the cave systems. Oh shit. Oh, so we jumping, huh? Y'all can't fight me one-on-one. -on -one. We gotta jump. I see how it is. Oh, shit. 
You got projectiles? I do too, bro. But my shit is high powered. You just got arrows. I bet he didn't expect that. I, I know a goblin did not expect me to pull up with a pistol. He said, what the? You know what this is also reminding me of? It's reminding me of uh, Streets of Rogue. <laughs> That's a fun ass game, Streets of Rogue. I might have to play that on stream again. Is that TNT? Minecraft TNT? Damn, they're jumping, bro. Y'all need a whole army to fight me. Oh, hold up, Mysterious Portal? Y'all need a whole army to fight me. That's crazy. Evil Protector. Time out. Need a potion in the hot bar. Oh, the gang is gonna help against the Evil Protector. Let's get it, gang. See, these guys are taking more initiative than Terraria NPCs ever do. They, as soon as I activated this, they came out here like, let's get it. Is that the boss over there? What the hell is that thing? Yes, sir. Help me out, Sean. Help me out. This thing got a lot of health. I gotta stop clicking. I, I, like, I forget that you could just hold it down. Yeah, take care of them, Sean. Sean, you take care of them. I'll take care of the main boss. Good job, Sean. Oh, where'd he go? What the fuck? Is he in the air dropping attacks on me? This is revolutionary. Oh! Oh, he come back down. I'm gonna die. Dave, the traveling merchant, is leaving. Dave! <laughs> That shit kind of hard, huh? I don't think I was uh, ready for that. I blame Dave. He could have helped us out. I can respect a goblin that fights me one-on-one. -on -one. I can never respect a goblin that has to resort to jumping me. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of liking this game. <laughs> I don't know. There's something about it. It's similar to Terraria, so I feel right at home. But it also has its own uniqueness to it that makes me want to play it some more. Oh, that boy had a trap? He had a trap in here? I didn't even notice that. Get that shit out of here. What an arrow trap? Do you think I could use that myself? Fuck Terraria 2. I'm already playing it. I don't gotta wait for it. I'm already playing it. All right. Come on. Rematch. Rematch against the giant enemy spider. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. He didn't even stand a chance against me. He didn't even stand a chance. He's in the hood right now. I pulled up in Chicago. I'm in the wrong part of Chicago, bro. Equip and hold space to sprint. Oh, yes. Yes, sir. We got our Hermes boots. Oh, damn. He's true. Oh, my God. He is sprinting, bro. He's getting out of there. Start with the pantaloons. Do we get a set bonus? Oh, there is a set bonus. They even got set bonuses in this bitch. This game really is amazing. Let's do it. I think I think we could do it. I think we got it this time. Hey, where's the angler at, bro? <laughs> You're a part of this village now. You gotta help. Carl's out here putting his life on the line. This shit telegraphing my movement. You see this? Damn, he, he's he's speeding up. Let me use the pistol a little bit. Hold up, different attacks. This shit kind of clean. Oh my god. Ah. Oh, yeah. Good dodging, Game Raiders. Good dodging. Hold up. Kill that portal. No summons. Oh, the angler woke up. Are you going to help us? Me and the elder are putting our lives on the line out here, bro. Man, let me get in here. Let me get that last melee hit, baby. Yes, sir. We took the dub. Shout out my boy, Sean the Elder. Fuck the angler. <laughs> that boy wasn't helping at all. Cool ass game. I like it. I'm honestly interested in it. Might play some more. All right. So I give Nessus a nice nine, even 9.5 out of 10 in terms of rating. I really enjoyed it. Really had fun playing it. It had a lot of similar features to Terraria and of course expanded upon its own unique features and aspects. And it made me feel right at home while also enjoying, you know, a new type of gameplay. But let us go on to the next game, which is Planet Centauri. Enter a name, Boo Bonicus. Pl plague -cus. new world when was the bubonic plague it was like the 1700s <laughs> europe 1700s 1300s i was off a couple of, a couple hundred years whatever europe in the 1700s still was pretty bad shit anywhere in the 1700s was probably still bad okay little cutscene. i don't know what this is on the side but i'm liking the cutscene. <laughs> 
Bro, we were in that cool armor, and then this is what pops out. Why do I look like this? Why is, like, the lower half of my body, like, an ape? <laughs> Welcome, young Earthling. You arrived despite yourself in a very dark period of this planet's history. <laughs> See, he knew I was trying to go for 1300 zero. He said dark period of this planet's history. So far, already got a better tutorial than uh, Edge of Space, but that's pretty easy to do. They were defending like the dumbest thing too. They're like, the first review on Edge of Space is unfair because you don't know how to read and you didn't want to follow the tutorial. It's like, bro, I don't want to play a video game that makes me have to watch a fucking video <laughs> instead of just slowly teaches me all the aspects of the game see this is how you do a tutorial it might be a little slow but at least i'm not reading paragraphs on paragraphs and have to watch a video <laughs> meat rack anybody want some meat let's get some ore it's nighttime. hopefully i don't get assaulted why is that chicken got poison on it oh hell nah the chicken got the poison how do i use my sword i'll right click got it them chickens are right get them get those chickens oh shit First fight, zombie. Wow, I do zero damage. But I can swing a lot. Oh, I can hold it down too. I can hold it now. I got the. Oh my god, did he just throw up on me? I'm really about to get the bubonic plague in this. It's something like every game having vines. <laughs> every game has vines in the cave. Oh, chickens. I cornered the chickens. I'm making mad chicken today. Yes, sir. I'm about to open up a Popeyes or a KFC with all that. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Whoa. What the fuck? <laughs> so I'm noticing like a bunch of the enemies have like elemental powers on them. Like some got like fire on them. Some got uh, electricity. I don't know what the hell that one had. Oh, look, those guys got fire on them. I don't got the weapons for this. Actually, you know what? This is not a terrible weapon. I am about to die. I did die. Okay, rest in peace. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, combat in this game, mundane. That's a weird word. Dude. The combat in this game, low key, boring as hell. Fighting does not feel exhilarating. I'm just holding down right click. I got him. Does water have physics? Let's see. Water physics. That is like literally. <laughs> that's gotta be the exact same code and look of Terraria. OG water physics. I like this. Just made my own spell? Yes, sir. That's kind of cool. The spell making is kind of cool. That reminds me of uh, Oblivion. Was there spell making in Skyrim? I don't remember. I usually don't play mage too often. That's actually a lie. I played mage the last time I played. Stone wall? Oh, there's previews? Yo, I'm an earthbender. That's kind of clean. Okay. Okay. I see you playing this Antari. Kind of clean. I like this. I like that you can make spells. And then I like that they have even like a whole preview window for it. You could probably do some crazy shit with it too. Like you could probably like combine stuff. Like look at this burst. What the heck? This might be crazy as hell. Hold up. Circle. Square. Ground. <laughs> oh my god now that's a spell right there. <laughs> can i make this spell that would be amazing if i can make that spell oh i need more points no <laughs> how many points do i need i need 75 no that would have been crazy if i can make that damn <laughs> That kind of it kind of makes me want to play to get that. It kind of makes me want to play to get that. But at the same time, how long have we been playing? We've already been playing for like an hour almost. It's a cool game. It's a cool game. It's definitely got its uh, things that stand out from just being, you know, a Terraria-like game, which is what you like to see. You know, if a game does inspire off of Terraria, you like to see them have all the base mechanics of Terraria and then expand in their own ways to be different. And honestly, almost like every game that we've checked out in this series or gonna be series has done that. The only game that I have played that I did not like was Edge of Space. Like, I could legit see myself playing every game I've checked out except for Edge of Space. <laughs> I like it. Cool game. Planet Satari. I give it like a 7 out of 10. It feels like a little bit slower than Kraya. And Kraya was pretty slow. I feel like these games that are like Terraria, they, they got a very slow beginning. But, like, that might just be because I'm so used to playing Terraria. And I know how, like, the beginning works in that. 
I know I know my goals and stuff. But like even like Starbound has a slow ass beginning. And I played a lot of Starbound. That's one thing I dislike about Starbound is the beginning. Like I'm just trying to get into exploring space and fighting all the bosses in Starbound. Let's get it. Making a new character, new world. Drawn to it, you approach this strange relic and raise a hand towards it. Upon touching its surface, a blinding light engulfs you. You are dead. <laughs> it turns out it was a untouched nuke that never went off. I think I like this like top down perspective more than the side scrolling perspective because core keeper has this perspective. Um, Nessus has this perspective. I think I like this perspective more. I don't know. I love when games got a quick torch feature, you know, that is something that all Terraria like games shoot. Even if you aren't a Terraria like, but you should always have torches easily accessible. So I don't have to waste a whole hot bar slot on them. This reminds me of those flash games you used to get on cool math. People think it was disrespectful for me calling Starbound a clone, but the fact you just called Core Keeper a game you play on cool math games. See, now that's actually disrespectful. I'm just a hater. See, at least you could admit to it. I ain't never even say a bad thing about Starbound in my video. Yeah, I got people wanting me to die because I called Starbound a Terraria clone. Yes, sir. My boy suited up. A lot of people were talking about like how Edge of Space looked like a Star starbound clone but i think edge of space came out before starbound but also starbound might have been in like alpha before edge of space might have possibly didn't look into it deep enough didn't really want to if i'm being 100 percent honest so people that were saying that are even bigger fools i'm gonna start the next terraria clone video with me opening minecraft what do you guys think <laughs> i gotta do some like super like troll shit on that next video I'm like, so the first Terraria clone we're checking out today is a game known as Minecraft. Oh, shit. Big boy alert. Big boy alert. Just give him a couple slaps before I dip. This is terrifying. This feels like I'm fighting the, uh, the flood from Halo. What the heck? That thing exploded. I'm fighting the Zergs from Starcraft. <laughs> it's piss. No, not again. I'm stepping in piss again. I finally found you, Glurch. Hit him. Throw the bomb. How, do, how the fuck does the bomb work? <laughs> hit him while he runs away. Oh, that's how it works. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Good bomb hit. Yes, sir. Yeah, come out here, Glurch. And then he's going to run away because he's a big dummy. And I'm going to get him while he's running. I mean, he can heal because he doesn't heal to full health. So I guess he can heal if he wants to. Ow. Got him. Got. Oh, my bad. I didn't mean to hit you, bro. <laughs> core Keeper, though. I would give Core Keeper a nice. Honestly, I'm going to say a 9 out of 10. It's still in early access. It still has so much potential to get better. And it's pretty good where it stands right now. Can be a little slow at times. That's a trend I notice a lot with uh, games similar to Terraria. Is like they can really slow down. Even Terraria itself has some moments where it slows down. I would say like having to mine ores in Terraria is an area where it always slows down. Like when you enter hard mode, you got to get your hands on the hard mode ores. Game slows down a lot. Yeah. Not a bad game. I think it's up there with Nessus. Nessus was like a 9, 9.5. So that was four more Terraria-like slash Terraria clones you might have not heard of. Make sure to leave suggestions for other games similar. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is going to keep on going as a little series. I did take big inspiration from Iron Pineapple. I love his videos that are like this. So shout out to him. I had people being like, give credits to this person. And then they said like some random name I've never heard of. I, I watch Iron Pineapple. I don't know who the hell else does videos like this. So the fact that people want me to give credit to those people I don't know, it's like, who the fuck is that? Why would I give credit to some random person? I don't know. But I will give credit to Iron Pineapple because I watch his videos. But yeah, again, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave suggestions. Make sure to like, make sure to sub. If you want to see the full streams of me playing these games, they will be on the second channel. So check out the second channel if you want to watch the full stream. Sub to that too. I'll see y'all next time.